Hi, I'm Sushi Mi. Want a luxurious bite without breaking your back? Creamy crab croquettes may be your answer. We start off by dicing a small onion. Next, we slice up a stick of unsalted butter. Take a quarter of your butter and melt in a pan. And in goes your onions. Cook until translucent. Pour in your crab meat. I'm using real crab meat here, but feel free to use imitation. Add in some salt and pepper for taste. Remove from heat and set aside for later. Pour in the rest of your butter to melt. Bring to a light simmer, then pour in your flour. What we are making in cooking terms is called a roux. Mix until you get a chunky paste. Add in your milk a little at a time. Adjust that fire to maintain a light simmer. Too high and your roux will burn. Keep folding till a smooth, creamy texture is achieved. Pour in your onion crab mixture. Everything that needs cooking is done so far. Turn off that flame and mix. Add in more salt and pepper for tasting. With a heat-resistant plastic wrap tray, pour in your filling. Even out with a plastic spatula. We are preparing to cool down the filling in the freezer for 45 minutes. To prevent ice crystals from forming, we tightly line the top of the filling, squeezing out as many air pockets as possible. After its time in the freezer, remove the top plastic liner. Slice up the filler to portion sizes you desire your croquettes to be. The freezing process thickened up the filler to where they can be shaped. Once shaped, dip your filler through the flour, egg, and panko breadcrumb stations. Fill a small pot with vegetable or corn oil about 2 inches deep. Bring the temp to about 400 degrees Fahrenheit before putting in two at a time. Take out once golden brown. Enjoy plain with curry or cocktail sauce. For the full recipe, look at the description below. If you've enjoyed this video, Smash that like button, comment, and subscribe. And as always, thank you for watching. Sushi Me, out of here.